Hi guys, welcome to the video. It's Tuesday, and this Tuesday I am I'm just I'm I'm ill. The germs are being very homophobic by entering my body. So I sound like a gremlin today, so welcome. This week I just wanted to talk to you guys about my favourite band at the moment, Mama Moo, because they've just had their comeback and they're gonna be coming back all year and I have never been more alive. More importantly, I received my first ever Mamma Moo album in the post this morning, Yellow Flower, and the thing that struck me the most about this album is how beautiful it is because it comes with this gorgeous booklet which has just all these gorgeous photos of the girls. Can't really. And I've never seen this kind of quality in any other CD that I've bought. I'm kind of used to getting CDs that look like this and um, okay this, this is quite a nice CD and yeah I'm not gonna shit talk Kate Bush because I love her but I, this is just it's a nicer format. I said it, it's a nicer format. More importantly, I got a photo card and I got Moon Buell and I'm just, I'm so happy. I was really hoping I would get her photo card. I was like, well, no matter who I get, I love them all. But you know, deep down, what I really meant was I hope I get Moon Buell because I'm, I just, she's the love of my life. And she's in plaid, which is really cute. So I thought I'd just go through the tracks of the album and give you my thoughts on them. Yeah, just, just buckle up. So I'm gonna skip the first track and just go straight to the second track which is Star Wind Flower Sun. <laughs> My tear ducts froze long ago so I'm crying internally. Oh it's so emotional. This is the third track Starry Night. This is the fourth track, it's Hwasa's solo. This is the fifth track, Rude Boy, also known as Moonbuel. Bop number two. Final track six and seven. Of course, the last track is Paint Me. How did I forget that? I literally made a reaction video to Paint Me as well. Oh, so s this is what I mean when I say subscribe for disappointment. I really love this album, it's very chilled out. I mean, you could sit and kind of study to this music, but you could also really bop out. You know, you could have like a nice whiskey or a nice herbal tea, and you could listen to this album. It's for everybody, it's really good. And this is just the first of four albums. I'm not gonna lie, I'm looking forward to Moon Buell's album the most because her voice brings me to the brink of the elusive female orgasm. <laughs> I've just... I'm so happy with this. I love her. I love her so much. The big question is, what do I think of Moonbeal's new hair? I actually really like it. I know a lot of people were kind of split and my honest opinion is I actually like it. She looks like a cute peach. She looks like a soft Cindy Lauper. She looks very kind of like soft 80s. I just, no, I really do like it and I think it's kind of fresh. It's cool. I think I'm gonna make a separate video about her looks because there's a lot to unpack. She's just very fashion wise and very stylish and there's a lot to talk about with her so I won't go on about it too much. I do personally genuinely like the hair though so I said it. Okay guys thanks for watching I hope that you have a great week. Don't forget to subscribe for Instant Disappointment and I'll see you guys next Tuesday. Bye!